Hello, Mr. L. Hello, Ethan. What brings you here today? Mr. L, I need your help. Gladly, dear boy. But how? So, all the gold has been stolen from my town. I want to help them, but I don't know how. Ooh, I think I can. There lives a rich, old, greedy dragon in a cave. He has plenty of gold. He could help you. The dragon? He won't give it to me. He'll eat me. Hmm. Perhaps if you just asked him nicely, you might be surprised. Follow this narrow trail; it will lead you to his cave. But be careful! Don't talk to strangers. Okay. Thank you, Mr. Owl. What are you doing in the forest so late, boy? Don't you know it's dangerous? I'm trying to save my town, and I'm not supposed to talk to strangers. <laughs> oh, a feisty one! I bet you'll be delicious. Oh, hello. I'm Quiver. Sorry about that. That pooch didn't hurt you, did he? No. I can lead you to the cave. I have a bone to pick with that dragon. In fact, he's the one who robbed your town. Dragon, my town is very poor. Could you please help us with some gold? What? Give you my gold? Why on earth would I do that? I worked hard for this gold. That's a lie. You stole all that gold from everyone. You even stole my golden acorns. I won them back. Hold your tongue, Quiver. You lost that bet fair and square. Now run along before I burn that cute tail of yours again. You two are disrupting my nap time. Dude, I have an idea. He's asleep. Let's sneak in and take back what's ours. I don't know, Quiller. We shouldn't steal from others. But it's not stealing. He took it from us first. We're taking back what belongs to us. And the time. 